Why? Tell me why are you staring at me? Okay, now that I've gotten your attention, I have a contest and a request. How is that? I'll be engaging in a fundraising campaign to fully rebrand my image and publish one of many books in the series. This contest is to fuel the video which will be featured on the Indiegogo campaign. With amateur, novice, and even professional voice talent, you will be rewarded if chosen, and if not, you will be honorably mentioned and featured on my blog. You will be given a chance to read from quotes, several different characters of course. These voices will give way to a final video which will be in the campaign. Why is there a campaign to earn money for me? Think of me as your investment. This will pay off. The first novel itself is with the editor and will be extremely ready by Christmas for pre-orders. I am hoping and praying for final release by Jan 12, 2015. By the way, I'll be 32. You'll celebrate with me, won't you? This series is my world. I've spent time building it. I wish to share it with you. If you engage in this contest, bring your voice to one of many characters that will be in the first and future books. I will have a sample, sadly, at the end of this video, of my quote-unquote vocal talent to show what the main character's attitude is from the first book. The script will be of the back of the book. The rest of the characters are up to you and how you perceive them from what scripts you are given. Prizes will of course include several different things, including paperback editions and Tale of Souls... Paperback editions of the first book, sorry. Uh, plus pin sets and some other swag created by myself. Those who aren't chosen, as said, won't lose out. All entries will go on my website. This contest is open to everybody over about the age of 15. Ethereal Phoenix is a division of Phoenix Fire Designs. Entries have already opened and will close August 1st. MP3s and YouTube videos accepted. File delivery information will be explained on my website as soon as possible. See you on the flip side. Disclaimer, I am not a voice actor. This is just so you can kind of get the information you need to understand sort of the attitude I'm looking for. I'm taking a $5 bet you can't walk in my shoes. What would you do if you were born a girl split into a trinity of souls? Of course, the kicker here is that two of them are male and the third being what you'd assume is the original. Uh, government projects, you gotta love them. Dreams, nightmares... Yeah, there's something I can't get rid of. They're terrorizing my waking and sleeping hours, and all I can see is different versions of the past and future, making me wonder if the present's really a gift or just a nasty refund from Target. I woke up with something different in my pants, and the ability to fuse every fiber of my being to someone else. Collecting every memory, ability, and everything in between. Problem is, I'm losing control, and nobody believes in me. I really can't keep track of who I am anymore. <sighs> Did I mention I was losing control? These keys are gonna open doors, and I'm trying to find my way home. They all think I can save the world, but guess what? I'm just some broken puppy. <sighs> it's Christmas at Ground Zero. The buttons have been pressed, and Santa isn't coming. So what are my choices? Do I bury my head in the snow, or do I lead everyone to redemption? I'm Justin David Terrence, and this is my tale of souls.